Good morning, everyone. It is a national holiday in Canada. It is Remembrance Day. Happy Remembrance Day, everyone. It is no school today, and today is when we remember those who have fought in the war. So you're probably wondering, hmm, what is Miss Teen Alberta Globe doing today? Well, I have been recently crowned as your Miss Teen Canadian Petite International 2020. So uh, that means I am preparing for my international competition in El Salvador this upcoming March. So I'm really excited and I've never been and I'm really excited. So I am going to be preparing all of my gowns, getting started on my national costume, my heels, my jewelry and everything like that. Queens and title holders, in order to be prepared for the runway or the stage or both, they have to get ready and prepare their gowns, their jewelry, their makeup, their hair, and everything like that. But most importantly, their heels. So queens and title holders, they would have four inch heels, six inch heels or higher. Now most girls I know, they can't walk in these heels, but I had that same problem before entering pageantry and now I don't have that problem because I know how to walk in shoes like these. So today I am going to teach you guys some tips in order to feel more comfortable in wearing heels. Tip number one, make sure that you get the proper shoe size when buying heels because if you have a size too big, there is going to be lots of room on the heel or, or and or the toe, toe. And if you have a size too big, then your heels are going to fall off often or there is a risk of breaking your ankles and if there is a size too small, you can barely fit in the heels, let alone walk, walk in them, and your feet are going to hurt. So make sure you have the proper shoe size. And a major tip, tip number two, wear nylons. And also make sure that your nylons are your proper skin tone, otherwise it's gonna look super awkward. But nylons will help reduce the swelling on the bottom of your foot, especially on the bottom of your foot right here. Because in the pageant that I recently competed in, the Miss Teen Canada Glow pageant, a lot of the girls didn't wear nylons when they were walking on stage and they had to take off their shoes a lot because their feet were swelling up and they, their, their feet hurt. So wearing nylons is very useful if you are rehearsing on your heels, walking in your heels, or being in your heels all day. These really help. These are a lifesaver. Now, if you are going to wear nylons, make sure that you cut your fingernails and your toenails because when putting them on or taking them off, the nylons have a risk of them running if you are not being careful enough and that has happened to me a lot of times so i have experience it's actually happening to me right now so just be very careful with nylons but these are a life saver so when you have high heels put on some nylons or tip number three if you don't have access to nylons Put on some band-aids so putting on band-aids you would put them on the heel right here and you would put them in most likely in this area because in some shoes like these ones right here the strap will rub against your heel when you're walking or standing in your heels and that will cause blisters right here and some blisters and right here in this part of the foot so wearing band-aids really really help and that will also reduce swelling but there is actually another tip if you just got to be very careful with the 
shoes you're going to buy because in the long run, maybe your shoes are not going to be so helpful to you when you are walking in them. So, and they might cause some blisters while you're wearing them. So make sure that you have a good pair of high heels. And if you want your feet to be extra, extra protected, wearing nylons and band-aids in certain areas that I have shown you really, really help. Bye-bye.